Sean and his friends are well aware of the crime in this neighborhood, but they're doing their part to try and change that. This neighborhood right now, because I know there's like a lot of robbery around here. So we're just trying to help out a lot of people to make their houses look nice. Sean, along with kids from area youth groups and officers from the Fort Walton Beach Police Department, are trying to start a trend. They are sprucing up one yard, hoping others will follow suit. We hope that the whole intention of it is try to make one house a little bit prettier so the neighbor will want to do it. It's keep up with the Joneses. That's what we really hope to do. Ida Mae Adams has lived in this house for more than 40 years. She says seeing so many young people working hard is a blessing. I think it's very good to know that they care, that we care about them. Right now, it doesn't seem like the leaves are going anywhere, but once we get finished, it it look pretty. The project has been in the works for about five months, and officers hope their hard work will pay off in several different ways. I just a little pride in the community and, and to show that the police department does do a little bit more than just arrest people and take them to jail. We do get out here and we do help out. We try to do anything that we can do to make the neighborhood and the whole community a little bit happier. A little happier and much prettier. In Fort Walton Beach, Molly Mangelsdorf, Emerald Coast News.